Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, and today I have a, uh, something really exciting for me. It's a, uh, unboxing of, uh, two Homeworks candles by Harry Slotkin. As you can see, it is still sealed. Um, I have never had a Homeworks candle before. I, uh, I've seen a lot of the, the rage online, um, and I know Harry Slotkin's stuff is good. I have a ton of his old stuff I'll show you here in a minute, um, but I have to say, I, I was um, I'm mad at myself because I missed, I saw, and I chose not to order um, some of his Christmas stuff uh, from the Christmas in July on QVC. Uh, yeah, Homeworks is exclusively available on QVC. Um, so I was, uh, I, I scoffed at, I don't know why, you know, I don't know why, I uh, I think it was the price. I, I have to admit, it was probably the price, because um, there's, there's two... Uh, you'll see two 18 ounce three wick candles. Um, it's about forty five dollars shipped. It's like forty dollars for a set, and like five dollars to ship. And um, I know they were on Easy Pay at the time, and I was just like, ah, oh, you know, I don't want to spend this. But um, the reviews came out afterwards, and they all sold out quickly. Um, and I, uh, you know, I, I don't know what what got into me, but anyhow, um, if. They come back this year, and I think they will. Hopefully, the same sense, maybe some little modifications. Firewood, firewood is the one that um, I think it was firewood. It was it was awesome. He, he described it as a uh, like a fireplace burning uh, scent, and it was paired with the uh, uh, frozen balsam. I think. So. I mean, it had to be an amazing combination. Anyhow, anyhow, Harry Slacking is probably one of the most um, respected names in the candle industry. I believe they call him the nose is his nickname. Um, not so sure. Um, but I'm pretty sure that's what it is. Anyhow, um, well-respected, uh, started Slatkin and co, um, early to mid nineties, I believe limited brands, which is uh, bath and body works, picked them up in the early to mid two thousands. And, uh, so they sold Slatkin and co, um, at bath and body works for, uh, numerous years. And that kind of, he left the company. I think he went on to do, um, party light and now he's back with homeworks um by harry slatkin so um and it just you know he made these three wick candles famous to what they are today so this is bartlett pear this is a 2009 pour i believe um 1950 remember those days and uh this thing is still going strong uh I haven't burned it in years. Um, it's probably been since 2009, honestly, since I've burned it. But the the scent is still still in here. Um, no performance with the wicks. You know, pretty good burn. You know, if we're gonna you know review a almost a ten year old candle. Um, you know, he had deck the halls, which was famous back in the days. Um, here's our fresh balsam that we all know and love today. Um, the original. Twisted peppermint. Now these guys, shockingly enough, these little guys, these they're one point six ounces. They've sold for three dollars and fifty cents back in the day. They're still strong. This only has a dust cover on it with a couple holes on it. They this still smells like twisted peppermint. Uh, if you were to go buy a twisted peppermint today, this still has that scent. Um, and of course, uh, homemade cookie. So I just want to give you a little brief history. Of it, but so my whole idea behind this unboxing, um, and I don't want to go ramble on and on and on, is uh, I wanted to be true. I, I didn't want to get get caught up in the hype and say, oh, you know, these are amazing, um, and without even really, you know, uh, knowing anything about them. So um, I chose let's just do an initial impression, completely honest, completely raw, unedited, one shot, um, see how it goes, and um, you know, hopefully this will. Uh, help you guys decide to make a purchase, um, on these candles. And I was waiting for something, um, well, I'll let you, you know, let's open it. Let's just do it. So sealed still, still sealed. Only, I, only thing I took off was the, uh, uh, what do they call that? The packing slip. So let's, let's take a look here. I know unboxing on camera is kind of weird. So, uh, as you can see, you open it up and it's got a styrofoam piece on top. We'll take that off. And here we have the two candle jars. Mm, okay. Let's get these guys out of here somehow. How do I do this? Oh boy. There we go. Aha. 
take the lids off. That goes there, that goes there. Don't want to mix them up. There we go. All right. So, I'm going to throw that over there. Uh, very nice. Okay, so, I'm going to put these down here. And we're going to start with... This is called Citrus Garden Mint. And uh, it is 18, like I said, 18 ounces. And the set notes on this are Italian lemon, black tea, garden mint, sparkling grapefruit, and purple leaf basil. Now, these come with a little dust cover on top of another dust cover for some reason. Not completely sure. So this is very, very lemony. Not overly heavy on the mint. Um, as you can see, the three wicks are a little, little close together. Um, I'll check the other one out, but... Um, so the mint comes in it's more of a, a tea it's like a lemon tea then there's the mint afterwards there this is just this is very nice this is um the lemon in it is a, a fresh like a fresh sliced lemon um not a cleaner scent don't even don't even think about it as a cleaner scent not not a cleaner scent at all it, you know this this smells like um, my grandmother would make black tea and she would just put some lemon in it. She would get like, um, you know, just like the regular, uh, Lipton black tea or whatever, uh, brew it up all day, put it in the fridge, you know, uh, iced tea. And then she'd take the lemon, she'd squeeze it in there. And when you get the seeds, you know, the, the lemon seeds, that's exactly what that smells like. So we have a 360 degree wrap around label. Very nice. It is removable when you're done. And uh, no issues with the uh, anything at all. No chipping. No chipping or anything. It made it here safe. Very happy about that. And uh, anything else to know on here? Burn time is 30, 30 to 55 ounces. Like I said, 18 ounces already made in the USA. Uh, Harry Slotkin. Homeworks by Harry Slotkin. So. Very, very nice candle. And here is the lid. Um, has his monogram on there and uh, these are substantial so if I were to show you his new candle versus the original Slotkin & Co you can see kind of the difference there and if I were to put this on top there's your difference there 14.5 ounces 18 ounces this guy's a monster um, one thing I did say that the shipping let's put the Put the dust covers back on for the heck of it. Um, seven pounds to ship two candles. So when you're paying $5.50 to ship it, um, that's uh, seven pounds right there. Now here is the one I was really looking forward to. I had asked some of the Facebook groups ahead of time um, if this candle smelled like uh, an orange grove, which is what I was thinking. I Harry has a lot of... Um, uh, floral scents right now and he did the whole tropics um where he paired a like a island scent with um an alcoholic beverage and i don't really do the alcoholic beverage scents um that that doesn't really appeal to me so buying them as a duo um i didn't, didn't work for me so I, I i passed but then this set came out and i was like i gotta try this i've got it i love a good citrus love a good love a, any kind of good citrus scent love it Oh, yeah. Okay. So this is, what is this? This is Clementine Blossom. So label's kind of similar um, to the uh, Garden Mint, Garden Lemon Mint, because they are citrus, citrus fruit growing on trees. Mm, this is, this is very much an orange grove. <laughs> very much. <laughs> I know a couple of the other guys out there. I know Tina Delicious said it was uh, pretty much an orange grove too, and this is... This is definitely, definitely that. You know, um, I'm a big Disney fan. Uh, ever been on Soarin'? And when Soarin', you're going, you're flying through the orange groves and they have the scent um, in your face. I love it. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. So this is 
Fragrance notes, clementine flower, fresh bergamot, neroli, and tangerine. That all, oh my gosh. I might have to reorder a set of this. This all is all coming through. It's very orangey. <laughs> I know this video is running long, 10 minutes for two candles. Sorry, guys. But I, like I said, I wanted to give you my raw, uh, unedited, uncut. Um, I paid for these myself. So, um, you know, I, I went on the easy pay because they were uh, $40, then uh, $5 a ship on easy pay. Uh, four easy pays for this time. And it was, uh, then I got a $5 off coupon because it was my very first QVC order ever. And they give you a $5, $5 off your first order. So I went with that. And uh, now these wicks are a little different. I'm not sure if you can see. They're, see how they're kind of, see if I can focus in on that. Um, they're not round at the top. They're more flat. So um, I'm not sure if uh, Harry can describe that or not. But it has something obviously to do uh, with the burn. So, I am um, <laughs> very impressed, um, as you can tell, and I'm very mad at myself for skipping out on Christmas stuff because Christmas um, is my jam on all of that stuff. So, these, this set is absolutely, absolutely gorgeous. Um, highly recommend this set. If you don't like florals, but you want something fresh and clean for spring into summer, um, these, this set would probably do it for you. Um, check it out while you still can because his stuff does tend to sell out. So, all right, guys. Well, thanks for watching. Um, don't forget to subscribe. Um, hit the like button. You know, give me a thumbs up there. Um, follow me on Twitter and Instagram at Philly Candleman. Um, I will have a lot of new, uh, interesting content and videos coming up there. So, uh, check me out. And uh, thanks for watching, guys. Have a good one.